Hello everyone, my name is Anubis Lives, and I am your VTuber Senpai. I've been asked several times if it's possible to stream with two VTubing avatars at one PC. And what I mean by this is if there is two people living in the same household but they actually only have one computer, is it actually possible to get the two avatars running on the one computer at the same time? And after some extensive research, I actually found out that this is definitely possible and I will show you how. But make sure you watch until the end of the video so you know exactly on what kind of equipment you need and how effortless and easy this actually is. But before we jump into the video, I do have one favor to ask you, and that is to like and subscribe. By liking the video, you actually help the video get discovered by the algorithm, and by subscribing, you actually help the YouTube channel get more perks on YouTube. So if you like the content on this channel, make sure you smash those buttons and well, Let's get into it. We have many options on how we're gonna get both of these models running on the same PC. Let's break this down the simplest way possible. For the best results, we're gonna need two webcams and two microphones. If you need a suggestion for webcams and microphones to use, you could actually check out my kit.co in the pinned comments down below. But if you can't afford another webcam or microphone, don't worry, I still have you covered on this. Then we're going to need two VTubing applications. I suggest VC Face and the other one would probably be something like 310A or V Magic Mirror if you can't afford another webcam. And the reason for the two webcams is because the one webcam can only be used by one application at a time. So let's check out to see on how much system resources these actually take up. And as we see here, running both applications at the same time takes approximately 30% of your CPU resources. And of course, mileage will vary depending on the specs of your computer. Okay, so as we see here, we have our two V2 models that we want to use. What we want to do is actually assign each model to a piece of software, just like this. If you don't know how to import your model into those pieces of software, please check the note card that's appearing just above right now, as I have tutorials made on how to import those models. Then once we have our software assigned to that specific avatar, AKA importing your avatar into that particular piece of software, what we wanna do is assign webcams and microphones to that one particular piece of software. But you're probably wondering to yourself, hey senpai, how do I do this? So let's use VC Face for an example. What we're gonna do is go to settings, general settings, we're gonna scroll down about halfway until we see device setting. Then you're gonna click on the little drop down select the particular camera you want for this particular model and then same thing with microphone you want it to select to that specific model then once you're done that you're good to go and here on 310a all we need to do is click on this little button here that says make avatar adjustments select our webcam under the webcam tab drop down boom we got the logitech c920 link sync type you could have it to audio recording and there's the assigned microphone. But wait a minute, what if I can't afford another webcam or microphone? What do I do? What you can do is share the first microphone with your partner and then change your audio recording to facial recognition. And what that'll do is every time you open your mouth, the mouth of your avatar will open as you do so. The reason why you want this is because when the other person is using their avatar and talking into the microphone, your avatar is not activating and looking like it's speaking. But wait, we are not done yet. There is one more thing we need to do. So this is where VMagic Mirror comes into play. Now, because we don't have a webcam on the second person, what we're gonna do is we're going to add lip sync and we're gonna select microphone. And then because VMagic Mirror is kind of designed for people that don't have webcam, you can actually use your mouse to look up and down and all that fun stuff. So it actually makes it look like your avatar is alive. Not only that, you also get a little mouse pad and keyboard. So when you're typing or moving your mouse around, you can actually have it replicate on this virtual mouse and keyboard. Once you have all your different pieces of software up and running and assigned, all you need to do is just import them into your sources in your OBS. And again, I have tutorials link up above on how to do that for each piece of software. And this is what the end result kind of looks like. You have two avatars sharing the same screen when you import them into OBS. And just like that, you have everything set up and ready to go. You're ready to start your streams. Again, my name is Anubis Lives. I am your VTuber Senpai. I stream on Twitch every Monday, Wednesday, Friday evenings. Links for my Twitch and all my social media in the description down below. 
and well, I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.